Yo, what is up everybody? Exus here and welcome back to Apocalypse Party. Today we are going to be playing the football player with Velocity Impact, which is affected by movement speeds. Collisions with enemies knock them back and deal weapon damage. Faster movement deals higher damage. Of course. Movement speed increases as you move, max increase 40%, reset when taking hits or coming to a halt. We're going to go to Chapter 3 of the Nightmare and let's see how this goes. How is everyone doing today? I hope everyone is doing well. I am doing fantastic. Excited to be playing once again. And as you can tell by the thumbnail, it is time. This is a voiceover. Um, I had to do quite a few runs to get the wheelchair. But obviously me talking isn't spoilers because the thumbnail is the spoiler that we got the wheelchair finally. This run is fun. It's actually quite ridiculous. And someone suggested a football player and it made sense, obviously, because collision. Uh, what do we take here? I think we just take. Do I take anything here? No, I think I reroll early. Yeah, I was like, that's not good. <laughs> I think we just take toad style toad style. Yeah. But we are hunting. You will see that I am trying to go as fast as possible chest to chest because, like I said, I already did a few runs and I didn't complete the runs. What I did was I played like game timer wise until about 10 to 12 minutes. And if I hadn't gotten it by then, I just restarted the game. The first game I played for a while because I was actually just having fun. That would have been a good video, too, because I was going like 600 percent movement speed, but that wasn't what we were going for. Um, but you do have to switch to melee as fast as possible. Thankfully, the first weapon we got out of a crate before we leveled up was a melee weapon because the wheelchair is a melee weapon. So you want to start stacking melee talents. You don't want to get firearm talents, even though the football player starts with a firearm. You want to switch to melee. So that's what we did. And so we just go through normal here and we find a legendary sword right away. And I was like, oh, this is going to be fun. But I'm like getting a legendary that early. I'm like, ah, there's no there's just no shot. We're going to get the wheelchair, too. But we do. This is a great weapon to have for the early game. Just makes it a lot easier. I didn't want to get lightning. I didn't want to, like, really change my only frost. I like frost. You know me. I like frost. But I don't think I went Arctic Guardian. I think I just, yeah, I took movement speed. I'm like, I got to be fast. Got to be fast. Got to go fast. It's all about collision and movement speed. So I am running, not running out of ideas. It's just we're already on like we're almost on episode 50. And I'm thinking episode 50 might be the finale for this game, at least for now, until there's any updates or, you know, anything like that or new characters added. I might throw one here or there. But I feel like it's just it's met it's it's met it's uh, not end, but it's slowing down which is just how games work. What do I take? Do I take hype train? I don't think I do, but I'm like collision and fire. And I was like, wait, as soon as I took it, I'm like, wait, we're not keeping this weapon. I do take hype train, though. I'm pretty certain. Yeah, I was like, as soon as I took it, I was like, man, we're not keeping the fire weapon. <laughs> but that's OK. I didn't want to waste rerolls. But yeah. Uh, more games obviously coming to the channel. I know sometimes they don't show up for people or people are just not interested. And we got the wheelchair two minutes and 53 seconds in and we got the wheelchair. And let me tell you, this thing is so hard to control because you can't use your your WASD keys. You have to use the mouse. And when you start going as fast as we end up going, it's it's ridiculous. <laughs> There's so many obstacles in the way that you just get stuck and we constantly lose our our buff passive. What do I take here? I don't remember. 
Do I take the damage boost? No, I take that. I think I take the bottom one. We electrify state them. Yeah, so every time we hit them, we we apply electrify and I figured, you know what? We're collision. Sure, why not? But this thing is unreal. It's super fast. And I honestly wish you didn't swing with it. I wish you just rode around in it. That honestly would be so much better. But it is so hard to control. But it's also ridiculously fun while trying to control it. But yeah, uh, we will be playing a lot of different games on this channel. So, you know, if you're interested, you know, please subscribe and just check back because I know a lot of people say that, you know, the ones that only come for like Apocalypse Party, they don't see other videos posted on the channel because it's not what they're normally interested in so just check the channel see if there's anything you like uh and let me know if there's any games you want to see but we're constantly looking for new games we're con i mean i'm constantly on steam just looking for new games i think i take the snow white because i'm like let's get frost and it gives us three frost damages which is you know 45 percent damage and we get frost when we um, colliding with people. So perfect. <laughs> and look, how I got stuck. I was like, ay, ay, ay. But yeah, a lot of different games coming. And I know they're not going to do as good as this, but sometimes it's just you have to move on. And I'm hoping it doesn't kill the channel. <laughs> That's always a worry when a good game like this one starts not doing as well we get hit a lot here i'm like uh oh my bosses are gonna be a problem and many people have said that and the faster you move the more damage you deal body slam super good and look how fast we're already going i'm already terrified i'm like okay just run around smacker spin around her and just watch out for tornadoes because i'm like oh my word this is so difficult <laughs> i got stuck got hit because i got stuck and i'm like I'm like, please don't die after we tried so hard to get this. I was like, ooh, should I get the frost breath? Just in case we die. And I was like, maybe. But I'm like, it doesn't sound like it heals me. So I'm like, nah, let's just reset, which I'm already down to two resets. And then we get Elsa, which was a great reroll. So I think we take it. I'm almost certain we take it. Yeah. <laughs> so we're just rolling around. I think we take the thunder one. Yeah. So that was crazy. I start walking around because I'm like, man, it's so hard to control. But then I'm like, got to go fast. Got to do it. Lightning does a lot. It, it does. It's not my favorite sacred ability. I don't mind it. And you don't have to teleport back to it. You can throw it wherever you want. I didn't realize it was a throw. I thought it went where you went. And then I use it, I think, over here somewhere. And it's nowhere. No, it's in the when I'm in the keep or something. I can't remember if it's the keep or the cave. I throw it and it's nowhere near me. And I'm like, what? <laughs> but that's okay. I was like, I'm going to stay here. I can do circles. We can just be NASCAR. But then I'm like, that's no fun just to watch me stay here for who knows how long. Let's see. I wasn't even going the right way for NASCAR. 
There we go. Switch it up. <laughs> but we, we start going very fast, having like really no issues with enemies. The only issue is getting stuck. That That's really our only issue. And I think I go missionary because it restores 1% sacred ability energy after a certain distance traveled. And we are so fast that it just sounds really good. And I'm like, oh, we got I'm like, we got to cast it. We got to see how how long it takes and it it goes up pretty quick. Like as long as we're moving, it goes up quick. But we're hitting all kinds of walls. We're hitting everything just terribly. Everything is an obstacle in this game. I think I get stuck on this little anvil like so many times. I think I go evasive maneuvers. I honestly could have went the top one too. But we're just like not moving in a straight line most of the time. We're, we're usually doing in circles. And. And yeah, this. Uh, this run was hard. Purely because the movement speed was insane. See, stuck on that, stuck on the anvil, stuck on the statue. Trying to kill Ice Shot. Getting stuck on that one. Thankfully, we went invincible there. We would have got hit. I don't remember what I go here. Do I just go indulgence? No, I reroll. Okay. I don't think I like any of these either. I think we reroll again. Should have maybe went Alexander the Great. It might have worked. I just know I didn't like a lot of things. Do I take just Queen of Atlantis so I don't have to reroll again? Or no, I take the ninja intern. Right? I have to. Melee damage? Yeah. It's. I was reading it. It says weapon damage. And I'm not sure. Is melee considered weapon damage? I don't know. But we're going it because it gives movement speed. And then I get super stuck on a pillar. I will never, ever, ever do a wheelchair run again. <laughs> I don't like it. It is not my friend. And I take a, I think I take a massive amount of damage against this boss because his fire that he does, does so much damage. And I thought we were gonna die. Like there's this fire, 20 health, 20 health. I'm like, uh-oh, uh-oh. I'm like, you can't, I'm like, you can't die. You have the wheelchair. But don't get me wrong, even though I don't really like this weapon, I had a lot of fun playing it. But I did. I recorded a lot and I just wasn't, you know, no voice just so I don't have to keep talking so it doesn't hurt my throat. And I'm like, what do we go here? I'm like, Scythe Curses goes faster with your movement speed. So it spins around you faster depending on your movement speed. So the faster your movement speed, Technically, the more damage you're going to do because it's going to spin faster. Which is good. But yeah, I had a blast with this. It's just it was a lot of recording, but I was just recording and watching some streams on my. On my iPad. Because I'm too lazy to do like audio inputs so I can watch like stuff on my desktop while I'm recording without it recording that sound. <laughs> I'm a very simple person. I like to hit record, hit stop recording, upload the video. I don't like editing. I have editing software, but if I don't have to edit. It's it's just better for me. I'll never, ever be one of those heavy editor people. Now, Mary Sue would remove the curses from us because the frost damage is considered a negative. And we don't want to remove any of the negatives. So I actually reroll here. That is my reasoning because I've done it before and it removes my curses. I was like, ooh, all damage, 30%. I was all like, that's pretty good. But movement speed. 
right? Nope, take all damage. I think I should have took movement speed. I don't think it would have been as much damage, but we would have been even faster. <laughs> I didn't look, really care for any of those, but I was sad. I was like, I'm like, we're getting hit a lot and we're getting hit very fast. And we luckily have two health things inside here. I'm like, awesome. So now we're back to full health. We need more armor. Our armor is very low. I did 805 crit damage on that. And we can cast our sacred ability quite a lot and quite fast. And I got stuck on the, the thing again. Do I just, yeah, I was looking at, I'm like, what is equipment? I'm like, do I just take this so I don't have to spend my rerolls, the bottom one? I was reading, I think Puppeteer. Ice Maker is okay. But I'm like, let's just take Puppeteer. So again, I don't know if, um, I got stuck again. I don't know if episode 50 of this is going to be the finale, but it very well could be. And I'm not really sure how to end it. I was thinking about ending it with the wheelchair run, but I don't feel quite finished with the game yet. <laughs> we only have one lightning. So I was like, ah, I, I really just didn't want to reroll. So I think I take frost mage. Or do I take that? No, no, I don't take that. I should have took that. I do reroll. I think I take War Titan because I need the armor. Yep. Need the armor and we teleport. Don't know why I'm really opening. And there's two more health uh, altars. I'm like, man, three health altars. I'm like, this is ridiculous. There's just only health altars. I'm like, we've been here before. But yeah, I know a lot of people are going to be a sad, upset that the series is coming to a close ish. Because again, I'm not just stopping. It's just there's, there's no updates yet. I'm sure there will be and we'll come back to it a little bit. <laughs> And the thing is, I'm still having fun. I really enjoy this game. But like Brotato, even though I enjoyed it a lot, I had to put it down. Magic Mirror. The Magic Mirror will create a clone of you to assist you in battle. The clone also has all your equipment and acts on its own accord. It can be attacked but not destroyed. The clone's equipment can only deal 40% of the original damage. I was like, wait, hold on. Does that mean it's going to be in a wheelchair? I was really contemplating it. Cause I'm like, does that work? Guess what? There he is over there. And guess what? He does go into a wheelchair. <laughs> Which I thought was really cool. But again, he's not as fast as me though. He doesn't take my movement speed. So he's kind of a slow moving guy, but it still, it still works. I think we just take frost mage. Yeah, that was the smart choice. We're level 18. We need to refill our armor. Just re I think I just realized that our armor was low. I don't know what I was doing. I see the armor over there and I don't go get it. I get stuck a lot on these streets. <laughs> like a absolute ton. I was like, I'm out of here. We're going up. I'm not sure if it's any better, but this is where we go. So yeah, if you just want to ha ever have just a ridiculous, uh, pretty much very hard to control run, a wheelchair with movement speed. And hate yourself for a while because you, you hit everything. 
Why didn't I go get that altar? I think I just didn't want to get stuck. <laughs> uh, I think I just take the top one. Karen Kur Kuruma. Gives us more armor. And I think it was, was the damage for armor. This is where I launch my, my sacred ability into no man's land. And then I realize it's a projectile. And I was like, where'd it go? I'm like, I hear it and I teleport to it to see and it's in the corner. I was like, oh, okay. I'm like, that's interesting. I didn't know you throw it. I knew this one would take me over here. Got to get the big wave of enemies. It's death, death altar, right? So let's call there something like that. But yeah. Spider-Man. Didn't really need attack speed, but it's okay. I should have just took Spider-Man so I didn't have to reroll. But then we get a Shadow Warrior mask. I'm like... He goes into a wheelchair, right? So it just kind of gives me a bigger lane of damage. I think. But it was. It was fun having him alongside me. <laughs> Any damage is good damage, as long as it's not against me. I just I I was getting a little frustrated how much I was getting stuck. And I was like, man. But we, we took one for the team. Because the wheelchair run has been actually requested quite a bit. So hopefully this run is to your liking. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. And I think we could have done more damage though with movement speed. I don't think we got the like the right talents, maybe. Or maybe I just didn't stack enough damage. Probably I didn't stack enough damage. But we do fine. Like, don't get me wrong. We're doing we're doing fine. Yeah, this was that was the wrong place to go. I tried to avoid it and then I went back to it. I don't know why. Uh what do I take here? Do I actually use my last reroll? I think I use my last reroll and suffer the consequences. <laughs> I think I do. Yep. I think I take the alchemy potion. I don't know why. I just, you know, I don't have any more rerolls. So. So why not? I could have took the frost switch or the mini eye switch, but. I don't like getting summons on non summon run because it just it just clouds your. Your 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 talents and it just for some reason it gives you a bunch of summons which i again that's a good thing because that means the tag system is working but when you don't want those summons when you don't want summons and you constantly get summons it's, it's quite it's quite annoying to say the least We are just, we're absolutely just bulldozing everything in sight. I'm like, I gotta use my sacred ability more. It comes back so fast. We are so fast too when we're using the wheelchair. <laughs> like, look how fast we're going. I'm like, this is ridiculous. I'm like, we are gonna die to the boss. Like there's just there's just no way we don't die to the boss, right? <laughs> oh, which one do I take here? I think I take Iron Man. Iron Man was really good. I get armor for each piece of equipment, and we have five pieces of equipment. I think it's five per for equipment. Which is good. We needed it. 
I'm like, all right, I'm like, all right, we're level 22. I'm like, do I just stay here for, for three levels? And I can't remember if I do. I might, because I'm like, we're getting a lot of experience. Enemies are coming in. We're leveling pretty quick. Don't love running into the fire guy. I was trying to avoid him. We take a little bit of armor, and I don't think I have at this point, and I don't know if at any point I get um, talents to give me armor back. Which I missed one, I know I did, but I think we just take the biker gang. Oh no, I take a Philly shell maybe? It's, nah, biker gang, right? Movement speed? Yeah, movement. I was like, yeah, movement speed. I'm like, if we're going to lean into the movement speed, lean into the movement speed. And I don't know yet. This still might be the finale. I'm, I'm, I'm teetering. So if it is, thank you all for all the support you've shown to this game and, and these videos. It, it's ridiculously appreciated. I can't thank you all enough. Um, this would be like a good run to leave it off on. I'm just not sure yet. So if it's not the last video, disregard this message. If it is the last video of this game for now, thank you again. And I hope you enjoy me enough and enjoy the channel enough that you would like to watch my other content. But I totally understand if you don't. I really do. So... So yeah, just not sure yet. I guess you'll know if there is no video the day after this one's released. I guess we'll both kind of find out. What do I take here? I think I take Frost Forager. Maybe? I don't remember what I took here. This was such a bad level 25 skill. Oh, these bosses were so... I'm trying to be fast with these bosses and they do so much damage. Again, I will say... I wish armor or there was talents to reduce damage taken. I should be able to be super tanky and I know it's because of like infinite and stuff like that, but, but yeah, armor should be armor or just, you know, just as a talent or two that reduces damage and it doesn't have to be a lot but taking 32 armor damage at the end there was rough or um, actually a lot more which is okay uh, i don't remember what i take i think i take frost nova frost nova is such a good skill and we are frost and i'm like where can i get armor and i don't really have to rely on my wheelchair i am already very fast but i think i take it to zoom in here Yep, right after this one, because I know it's going to hit. I'm like, let's go. It was it was still rough, though, getting through there. And I think there's three armors in here. <laughs> we are zooming. And I missed it, but that's okay. I was going backwards when I was in there, in the tab. I was like, okay. Had I not gone backwards, I might have actually been able to take this teleport. But I decided not to just to not break the game at zero seconds. All right. So this, <laughs> I was like, I need to kind of stay away because of his wild swings. I knew he was going to go invincible, but I knew our sacred ability recharges very quickly for how fast we are. At least fast enough to not really stress using it. But I was like, okay, anytime he's doing a big swing, I'm out of there. I'm fast enough to avoid anything if I play it right. 
I was trying to dump Elsa <laughs> on him every time. I was trying to. Not every time, but I was I was trying. It's just it's really good damage. See, it's really good when he's stuck in that tornado. And now it's time for the Hell Titan. I took 70 armor damage from that. 70. I was like, oh my. I was like, well, we're probably dead here. <laughs> I was hoping I'd go fast enough to like confuse him. He didn't care all that much. I was like, you know what? I don't care if he's going to go invincible. Let's just get him to that stage. Use our sacred ability. It's a smart thing to do. At 10,000, he goes underground and becomes stationary in the middle. And I just have to avoid all the projectiles, which let me tell you, in a wheelchair going 100 miles an hour, uh, not easy. So I have to stop auto attacking at times. I was like, you know what? We're just going to go for it. And there it is. That was the wheelchair run. Again, if this is the last video, thank you all so much. I really do appreciate all of you. Thank you all for watching. That was, again, the wheelchair run. We had an absolute blast with it. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving a like and a subscribe. It does help out the channel greatly. Again, from the bottom of my heart, I really do appreciate all of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope y'all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Take care, and we'll see you next time. See ya.